I crouch down. So, <laughs> hello, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be talking about like clothes I recently bought like since it's been my birthday. There was obviously like I got birthday dis discounts in my email so I was like you know what I'm just gonna buy a load of new clothes <laughs> and yeah I thought I'd show you because I like filming clothing hauls. So yeah, the first thing I'm wearing which is new is this stunning like satin crop top from Topshop. I was gonna stand up and wear it but I feel like now you actually get a better view. So as you can see it is quite, it is a very deep kind of sweetheart neckline but like it's not so deep that everything is on show. I think it's personally like really flattering and like sort of the seams here really like sort of pull you in and like make your bust look bigger because I don't have big boobs at all. I'm a B cup so <laughs> yeah but um and but like I can lean over and not feel like uncomfortable if you know what I mean. So it's got like two kind of ribbon ties here which are like already sewn in so you don't have to worry about those. That should be it like that. Yeah so I think these are really cute and I didn't realise like with the back of this sorry, we'll have to stand up. So I'm wearing like my Topshop Johnny jeans and like you can see it just it's like a perfect kind of crop top. But the back of it is even more pretty. Like so it ties up here. So I, I probably wouldn't wear a bra on this, I'd probably just wear like nickel covers. But um yeah, this honestly looks nicer on than it does in, on the website. Um and I've just got my Tiffany's necklace on, which I think is stunning too. So yeah, this is definitely like a night out kind of top I feel like. Like I think I could, I'd probably wear some like black Johnny jeans as well, or just a black skirt. I think that'd be really nice as well. Um, but yeah, like I literally love it. I think it's so nice. We'll stand up for the next item. So again, this jacket is Topshop. Um, it's just an oversized. I got this in a size ten, and I've got to say this top is a size eight. Um, so yeah, this is just an oversized. I think it's called like a, a fleece lined bulk denim jacket. Um, sorry, the double denim is not a good look. But this would look fine with like black jeans, but. Honestly, it is so warm. I feel like this would be perfect for like nights out. Like we just want to throw something over you that will actually keep you warm. Um, I do have a cropped pink one from Pull and Bear, which I I do love. It's better for spring wear it because obviously it's lined as well. But like as I said, it's like cropped. It doesn't keep it as warm as, as like this does. Um, it's not lined in the sleeves as you can see. It's like lined in here. But oh my god, I love this. Like I did see another one on Topshop which was like a pink. Um, one which and the sleeves are like fleece on the outside which I might get because as I said these are these are practically like a lot warmer than like cropped um, jackets but um yeah this is so cute right this one I can tell you now is definitely going back like it looked a lot nicer online so this is from Nasty Girl it's a size 10 it's like a cropped I guess like glittery top Um, I think it was a co-ord but like in the sale I only came with this and I think it looks really cheap and nasty. <laughs> like, as I said, it looks so much nicer on I feel like if these bits were actually like sewn down, it would be a lot nicer. But where it's just like, it looks like a child's dressing up top. I honestly don't know. A solid no from me. Okay, I'm literally in love with this. So this again is from Nasty Gal. It's got like balloon sleeves. It's just a cropped uh, jacket, a cropped cardigan with like kind of shimmery. Um, buttons down. I actually haven't got a bra on, but like you probably wouldn't tell. Um, personally, I'd either wear this like a turtleneck for like this kind of weather, or just like a crop t-shirt because I have so many like crop white t-shirts. So I thought this is literally perfect to go over the top. Like as I said, you can wear the um, <clears throat> you can wear the cardigan like this, or you could like unbutton it if you wanted to. Um, but yeah, like, it looks so nice with blue jeans as well. Because I used to have this um, purple jumper from Topshop actually, which is which is like the same colour as this, but. As it was like, it was about four years old, so it was so like, as it had been washed so many times, like it just lost its shape. Um, but honestly, this is so nice, it's so cosy as well. As I said, I think it's really like perfect for um, springtime. Um, yeah, I absolutely love this. Okay, so next I have some trousers. Again, Nasty Gal. Like, I probably wouldn't wear it with this cardigan, but it kind of works. So they're just like, I don't know if you can see this, like, but they are kind of like grey uh, checked print. But it has got like a pink kind of line going through it. Um, I will say they are a little bit on the short side, like they're kind of already like pre-cuffed. Um, obviously where I'm quite tall it, it looks more cuffed than, oh my god, the state of my bed, I do apologise. <laughs> um, yeah, but obviously where I am on the tall side, it does look slightly taller, uh, slightly taller, slightly shorter. But the girl on the website, she was actually wearing these with like um, sort of DM style shoes. So I feel like these would look really nice, like I was thinking like I could wear these on like placement or... Like, I could wear these with, like, my Chelsea boots. I think that would look really nice. Um, 
But yeah, like I'm definitely gonna keep them because they're really flattering, and as I said, they come up so high, which is really nice. Um, but yeah, as I said, I like them. They're just a bit shorter than I expected, but I think they'll be good in springtime as well. Like. I know it's only February now, but like, you've got to prepare, you know? <laughs> okay, so, this jumper dress is Nasty Gal, so it's quite, it's got quite a high neck. Um, it's quite boxy, like, I know that's what they're meant to be like, but, I don't know, I think it's just not my normal kind of style. I might go to, like, Primark and get, like, a cheap kind of belt, just to kind of cinch me in a bit here, I think that would look a lot nicer. Um, my plan for this, um, dress is to probably wear it over my knee-high boot, I think that would look really nice. Um, but obviously on me, it's a, again a little bit short, but I can bend over and feel comfortable. Um, but I think if not, I'd probably just wear it as like leggings, just to be like on the safe side. But yeah, I think it's quite cute. I think again, it's probably nicer for like probably spring to autumn. But even just like lounging about in the house, I think it'd be really nice. Um, but yeah, I'm I'm gonna keep it. I think I think this is a size. I feel like this is a size ten. So, and the trousers before they were a size. Um, yeah, they're a size 10 as well. So the next few things are all from TK Maxx. So the first top, this is a size 8, but I feel like I could have sized down because it's quite, again, there's not much shape here. Like, I feel like if this was tighter, it would just look so much nicer. But anyway, the reason why I bought this stuff was, as I said, I'm going, I do have a school placement in my next semester. So I'm going to be in a primary school for like eight weeks, so like one day a week. So I didn't really have any like kind of formal smart sort of work clothes. Um, so yeah, I got this top first of all. I think it was about thirty pound, which I I know it's kind of pricey, but like it is a blouse. So yeah, um, and I, I do like the tie up detail at the front as well. But um, yeah, I think it looks really nice. I think probably it would probably look nicer like it would look more casual than like blue jeans. Um, but these black trousers are they're actually Ralph Lauren, as you can see. There's like a little sign there. Um, but I got them for £30, I think it's like really good. Um, <laughs> so they're, kind of, they're like bootleg cut, if I put my leg up, there we go. So which I think is good because I can, again, I can put my Chelsea boots under them like when it gets warmer, I can put my um, T-bar flats under them as well. But um, as I said, they're really like comfortable. These are a size 10, a little bit baggy around the bum, but like, um, as I said, not super duper noticeable. I feel like maybe after a couple of washes they might shrink down anyway um i think i need to unpick the pockets of these as well um but yeah as i said like i wanted to obviously buy like nice smart trousers because i don't know what job i'm going to go into after uni either um but also i just i didn't want to spend like too much money on them either but so when i saw this I was like this, that's exactly what i need as i said i've got those other like check trousers and i've got a pair of pink trousers but i didn't mean like black smart trousers so yeah so they're really nice and also i feel like if you're at school you could definitely get away with these as well as I said, they're not super duper tight um so yeah, TK Maxx is a good place for smart clothing. <laughs> so, again, this top is TK Maxx. It's just a button-up, uh, like, collarless top with, like, a black polka dot going through it. I didn't realise I kind of see through it underneath, but... Anyway, again, I thought it would just be perfect for my placement, and obviously when I start it, I'll be going into spring, hence why I've gone for the short sleeve. Um, but yeah, this was... How much for you? This was 16 I think it's quite good for, like, a blouse. Uh, but I didn't buy like heaps of stuff, as I said, I'm only doing it for 8 weeks, I do have like other uh, sort of white blouses which I think I'll probably just wear then. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go on to the last things now. Okay, so we've got a couple of new things going on here. So the first thing, this is actually from Pull and Bear. My friend, I went to Bristol recently, my friend actually pointed it out. Um, so this is obviously a long line cardigan, a bit different to the uh, lavender one. But I think, again, this would look so nice, like mum jeans, like sort of tucked in, I see a lot of people do that. Um, so it's got a like, black tortoiseshell button, which I think is really cute. This was, I think it was £18, and it is obviously really good for a um, cardigan, like especially a chunky one. Um, it's just got normal sleeves, not like balloon ones. So this is a size small, but it's like, as I said, it's perfect for me. And then underneath I've got like a um, play suit from Nasty Gal. So if you've watched my other Nasty Gal, well, you'll know I've got the grey version of this, but I literally wear it all the time. When I saw this in the sale, I was like, I'm getting it. So <laughs> this is a size 10, but I'm a bit confused because the black label, which is obviously sewn in, so I'm going to like actually talk to you. So yeah, the black label that's sewn in, that says, um, that says size 14, but the actual like sort of label which you would like scan in a shop, that says size 10. But this doesn't feel like a size 14 though, because my other one's a size 10 and it fits perfectly, so I feel like one of the labels is just wrong. Um, but yeah, if you're looking to get this, I'd probably say just get like your normal size. Um, it is a bit low like on the boob area, but like you can adjust the straps, so yeah. <laughs> that is 
my clothing haul for like February I guess, my spring clothing haul maybe I might call this, I don't know. Um, but yeah, if you like the video, please like and subscribe if you want to, and I will see you soon. Bye!